town of Blue Diamond today. This is just west of Las Vegas, even further west than the Red Rock Canyon. There's some awesome mountain biking trails here. Uh, Dave's gonna mountain bike and see what I got. Doggy backpack. Let's see if we can't get her in there. We have no idea if this <laughs> is gonna work, but we're gonna try. I don't think it's gonna work. You don't? <sighs> Little faith. This is gonna tread water. Well, if I get to hike in like right away, I'm gonna hike with no, her. I'm just getting her into it. Oh, well, I think it's a two person job, but you're gonna try and do it on my back? Yeah, why don't you just pick her up into it? Center. Okay. I don't know. All right, let's see how this goes. Okay. <laughs> on a bicycle because you're more like this right so it's more evenly distributed I don't know we'll see though did I mention that pistol she's totally chill back there I actually think she could fall asleep it's like the same motion when she's on the paddleboard or in a raft or something it kind of lulls her to sleep so I actually think that's a possibility Go. Oh my gosh. That was hard to climb up that hole with her, I have to admit. This will be thirsty. good I think I need to adjust it a little better because it's pretty heavy on my shoulders but if I raise her up a little bit I think it'll be all right <laughs> um, she loved it oh she did I was positive when she was in there she was gonna hate it but it was like as soon as she was in there she was like huh 
This is nice. Like eyes were closed. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. It was lulling her to sleep. I I'll, think. Uh, I'll take her on a easy mountain bike ride one of these times. Yeah, just like a flat. I bet she'd love that. I bet you're right. But seriously. Yeah, I, I mean, obviously she likes to hike, and we like to hike and keep her fit and strong, but. When we're at those places where there's lots of rocks that snake could hide behind, and yeah, you know, she'd just stick that. her snout in there, so I can she was pack her, her over the rocks. I happen to hold her in my arms, so yeah, yeah. So after we did the blue diamond um, <clears throat> hiking and biking, our son Jesse came into Vegas. He flew down from Oregon and. Uh, Tyler was supposed to fly in, but then he had a work obligation. He actually flew to New York instead. So yeah, it was like a really cool job in New York for a week. Or come see us. We're like go to go New to York. New York. Go to New York. You we'll, can see us anytime. We'll fly you back some other place. So right now we're actually in Lake Mead Recreation Area, but we're down out of Bullhead City. This is Catherine's Landing Campground. Um, but check out this footage we got when Jesse was here. We'll meet you back here and we'll show you the campground. And we will be baking cake today. Why would we bake a cake? I don't know. Pray tell. Is it someone's birthday? Actually, in this van, we don't... She celebrates a birth week. Or month or whatever. <laughs> yeah. <you know? laughs> That's not just one day. My actual birthday was a couple days ago, but we've, we've just been celebrating. But... I'm gonna make a cake, Dave's gonna bake a cake. So we haven't had a chance to do a birthday cake in the camp oven until today. So it's her make birthday, and bake. Her, and I gave her some small little gift stuff. It's really hard buying gifts when you live, live like this minimal lifestyle because everything we have has to have a purpose and you know, and it's I don't know. For me, I'm I'm not good at buying like, oh, she'll want a you know, some clothing thing and what color is she going to like? Because if you have a house and a big wardrobe, yeah, you, you, you can be wrong and it'll just go in the closet. She might wear it once in a while. But here, yeah, everything has to have a purpose. You know, she, she doesn't, I, I can't buy her bath stuff. No, I you know. know. He's like, you're not getting bath salts or <laughs> bubble bath or candles or. She did get a bunch of dark chocolate though. I did get a bunch of dark chocolate. So I actually made her something. I'm getting a homemade gift. Yeah, and she saw it in the early stages. I did. And then when I realized that, hey, I'll just give this to her for her birthday. Because she loves surprises and it's really hard to surprise her. I love to give surprises. I love surprising people. It's not that I want to surprise so much. It's just I love surprising people. Yeah, well, I'm sure that you love to be surprised too. So I decided that this little gift, little handmade thing, and I'll talk more about that when we show it but um yeah it's nothing spectacular but it's you know i always appreciate when i was a kid i used to do a lot of woodwork and i would make gifts for my grandparents and other family and i really enjoyed that so anyway well uh she hasn't seen it yet i kept it from her until she got a birthday cake so we'll yeah. actually let her show you for either surprise excitement or complete utter disappointment <laughs> well i mean i do know what it is but <laughs> i haven't seen the share. finished product and it's gonna help me make the cake so chew on that a while. We'll show you um, kind of what we did when Jesse was in town. Check it out. Hey, we're at New York, New York in Las Vegas with our youngest Jesse. He's in town to visit us. And they're going on, is this called the Big Apple? The Big Apple roller coaster. No, it is in New York, New York, but it's the Big Apple. It said something here, the Big Apple. I swear it's the Big Apple. Um, it's a roller coaster at the New York, New York. I'm not going on it because I don't think I'll enjoy it. Scared. A little bit scared. So I'm going to hold the backpack. There's no cameras allowed on the ride, of course, because that's dangerous. So um, well, I'll just be waiting here to meet them back here afterward to see how this goes down. This is it now. Don't get scared. It's a, it's, a, it's a good, hard, fast moving roller coaster, but it's like, it just beats the crap out of you. It's like my neck up. Hey, they both have whip now. Yeah. But it was awesome. Yeah. Let's check out this arcade.
Cake time, but I need my present first. You do? Yeah, what do we got? So, like we said before, she saw me in the early stages of making this. And so we needed we needed this item, and I needed a woodworking hobby that didn't require power tools, because my wood lathe and table saw won't fit in the van, so. <laughs> Anyway, I have these new tools. This is an amazing saw. It's uh, pretty wicked. Wow. Just for cutting branches or whatever you might need. A carving axe or hatchet. Razor sharp, by the way, will shave you. And then two carving knives. Obviously a straight knife and what they call a hook knife. And with that, I present you... What do we got? Your birthday present. Yay! Whatever could it be. Now, I've seen this early on. Oh my gosh. Wow. I saw this in its very early stages. It looked... Nothing like this. Wow, look at that. So this is redwood. It is so lightweight, but you can tell it's really strong. That's beautiful. That's a piece of art. Oh, thank you. Now you can make me something with it. I'm going to I'm going to make my cake with it. Yeah. See, it's it, um whoops. Was, so anyway, um it is super lightest redwood. It's probably not the best for a spoon, but when you're in the desert, there's not a lot of options for wood. Most spoon carvers, they'll go get um, green wood. Yeah. It's much easier to carve. They'll carve it down to a near final stage and then they'll let it dry and finish it. But I couldn't find any wood and we were in a Home Depot and I was looking around and I don't want to use pine because I'm going to pitch in it. I want something that's good for food. So they saw they had unfinished redwood two by fours. So this was a redwood two by four. Wow. Now it's a wooden spoon, but it, it, I'm surprised how durable it really is, how strong it is. It feels really strong. It might dent up pretty easy, but who cares? Yeah. And it's finished with walnut oil, which is like, you know, food grade. Food grade. Well, yeah. that's the most common for, you know, utensils is Linseed, mineral oil, and walnut oil are probably the, the three most common. Cool, I'm so, excited. Anyway, there you go. Let me get to mixing. I love my spoon. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Happy, happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy, not... happy, 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 happy birthday. Hey. That's not how the song goes. <laughs> Oh, the and many more. Song <laughs> the cake didn't really turn out, so we improvised and adapted. Um, this is what it is. I'm going to make a wish. 
Pistol says, you gonna I help wish, me? I'm making a wish right now, too. Yeah. I wish they would give me all the cake. I got something special for you, Bug. Okay, I'm going to make a wish. This is all it. All right. Make a wish, baby. Winner! Yay! You win a whole cake. You're not even going to try it? Oh, well, I'm it's definitely trying it. No, no. I think it's going to taste amazing. No, I do, too. Um... This is the problem with not really using recipes. They don't always turn out, right? So it didn't really rise and it's lopsided and it's more like a brownie, so. <laughs> but the, the, the coconut whipped cream. Yeah. And the, the, it, it's, yeah, it does, I mean, we tasted it. It tastes just like a brownie. It does, I know. Oh, I gotta get her goodie out here. Pistol, it's this. not your birthday. We've been holding on to this. Our friend oh. Wade gave this to Pistol. Thanks, Wade. Yes. Smart bar with bacon and apple. True treat for dogs. Do you think we should give her half or just give uh, Probably half. Okay. She already had dinner. Or, nope. Oh, giving her the whole thing. She's getting the whole thing. <laughs> On the cut. Oh, whoops, swishing <laughs> off. <laughs> kind of looks really good. Well, you know, I mean, I'll have this piece. All right. <laughs> <If it works. laughs> mm. Okay, even though this look, didn't look great, it tastes amazing. We'll see you guys back here in the next video. We'll show you around this campground or wherever we're going to be. Mm -hmm. See, and... even doesn't look good. Like, I think that's missing. What? <laughs> what is happening over here? Mm -hmm. All right, we'll catch you guys later. Carry on. <laughs> Carry on. It's okay, girl. I don't know. <laughs> Another <single word>. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> uh oh.